Hello guys, I hope you're all fine. Today we are here to discuss about nodal grounding. So let's get into the topic. Here, in this nodal grounding, nodal point of a three-phase system is connected to the earth. It may be connected directly or it may be connected to through some circuit element. This is called nodal grounding. And here, let's talk about the methods of nodal grounding. The first one is solid or effective nodal grounding. Here, nodal point is connected directly to the earth through a wire which have negligible resistance or reactance. This is the nodal point. It is connected to directly to the earth. By using a wire, it may have negligible resistance or negligible reactance. Here, where the second method is resistance grounding. Here, nodal grounding. Here, nodal grounding is connected. Here, nodal point is connected to the earth by using this resistance. By using this resistance, the nodal point is connected to the earth. This is called resistance grounding. Where the third one is reactance grounding. Here, nodal point is connected to the earth by using some reactants. This is a three-phase system. Where the next one is arcing grounds. Here, the surge voltage will be will be will be provided due to arcing ground. So, this surge voltage can be removed by using a arc suspension coil. This is the arc suspension coil. This is a three-phase grounded line. This is all about the nodal grounding and the methods of nodal grounding, guys. I hope you understand, guys. Thank you.